So you know him from uh, world-famous titles like Final Fantasy, Kingdom Hearts, it's Tetsuya Nomura, and he's done his own unique design for our DC Comics variant line for Batman and Catwoman. He's also put his unique spin on the famous Japanese vocaloid Hatsune Miku, as you can see here. So our Theater Rhythm Final Fantasy Static Arts Mini is a really cute line. Like our DC Comics variant Static Arts Mini, these are just uh, cute little solid PVC figurines. We have the Moogle, Chocobo, and Squall. And from Final Fantasy XII, we're sharing our Fran prototype once more. Uh, our director of merchandise just loved this character and really wanted the opportunity to get a chance to make a figure of her since he didn't get a chance to do the first time around. And here, probably the, one of the most popular characters from the Final Fantasy franchise is Cloud Strife as he appears in Final Fantasy VII Advent Children. Um, now he is going to be available in May at $120, but look at all the amazing accessories that are included with him. And uh, also note that on his pant leg there is a cape material that's made of real cloth with posable wiring. So maximum posability. You can also see a little chibi version of Cloud peeking in the background along with Tifa and Sephiroth, more of our Final Fantasy Static Arts minis. So our DC Comics variant Play Arts Kai line continues with the Batman Timeless series. Here we have the Bushido Batman, aka a Samurai Batman. So this is sort of our reimagining of Batman if he existed through all uh, sort of historical eras. Some are real and some are fictional. Uh, but this one is sort of uh, like ancient Japan. You can see him here holding two katanas and he comes with all kinds of cool accessories and amazing armor plating. This is an original design by our Japanese designers. Um, actually, our Japanese designer Hitoshi Kondo is the one and only designer for this variant line. And over here we have Spartan Batman. So this is sort of a Roman gladiator Batman. He comes with a spear. He has a long flowing red cape behind him. There's all kinds of cool bat details on his costume. Uh, you can't really tell, but on his shoulder armor, uh, there is sort of a like vampire bat looking uh, mask sculpted into it. And then of course, the Batman insignia is on his shield. Again, this one also designed by Hitoshi Kondo. And getting into our sort of more imagined time periods, we have Steampunk Batman. So this takes a sort of Victorian, Edwardian era technology based on steam engine power and uh, puts it into this Batman suit. Sort of like a Michelangelo flying suit design powered by steam. So you can see all kinds of cool cogs and gears in this design. And uh, probably my favorite detail is on his chest piece, there's a, a transparent piece of plastic so you can see the gears underneath. And finally, we have our Wild West Batman. So this is Batman as a cowboy. He comes with a grapnel gun, a lasso, a tomahawk, and even though he's wearing a cowboy hat, he still has his signature bat ears. Now this one is going to be out this summer. It's gonna be retailing at $120, and pre-orders are going to be up today, this third day of Toy Fair. So for years, fans have asked, and we're so excited to start answering that call with our Marvel Comics variant Play Arts Kai line. And swinging into this line, we showed off his concept sketch at New York Comic Con, but here he is, his full-figured prototype, Spider-Man, your friendly neighborhood variant Play Arts Kai. You can see he comes with all kinds of cool webbing features and effect pieces. And of course, he's got a lot of posability. Even in this prototype stage, you can see you can get a really dynamic pose with this awesome action figure. And of course, we're also really excited to announce that we'll be doing a variant Play Arts Kai of Venom. Unfortunately, the prototype wasn't quite ready for this show, so make sure you look out for the sculpted prototype at our next show. And being shown here for the first time is our Marvel Comics variant Play Arts Kai of Thor. So this mighty Asgardian comes, of course, with Mjolnir. And Mjolnir will have this really cool effect piece to make it look like you're swinging his uh, hammer through the air. Or you can make it look as if lightning is uh, coming off of Mjolnir. But you can also just pose it without any effect pieces at all. And there's a lot of great translucent effect paint on uh, Thor's helmet and armor. And of course, he's got these great Nordic looks and flowing blonde locks.
And already up for pre-sale, we have our Marvel Comics variant play arts guy of Iron Man. This really dynamic and amazing figure that looks sleeker than uh, ever before. Comes with all these cool effect pieces to make him look as if he's flying and also has these sort of thigh missiles shooting off from the sides of his armor. So this one is retailing at $120 and also will be ready in this summer. So please go to your local comic book shop and tell them to pre-order one for you today.